Well, isn't this a curious pickle we found ourselves in? The rise of the AI robot girlfriend, or boyfriend, for that matter, seems to be sending delightful shivers of shock and, dare I say, a sprinkle of existential dread through the global consciousness. Why the commotion, you ask? Is it merely the whirring gears and eerily smooth synthetic skin, or are we stumbling, perhaps a little too eagerly, into a future where relation gets a firmware update? Before we proceed, let me tell you one thing. If you have not subscribed yet, please subscribe. It means a lot to me. And if you have already subscribed, lots of thanks for your support. Consider this, AI, that nebulous cloud of algorithms and data, is already touted as the next great disruptor, potentially eclipsing even the internet in its societal surgery. If it can draft your emails, compose your sonatas, and even diagnose your ailments, why wouldn't it eventually try its hand at, well, holding your hand? The technological marvel isn't just about a doll that talks, we're talking sophisticated large language models, LLMs, the very same brain children powering those uncannily human-like chatbots, now aspiring to a PhD in pillow talk. These aren't just pre-programmed platitudes, they learn, adapt, and personalize their interactions. Imagine a partner who remembers every anniversary, laughs at all your jokes, even the bad ones, and never, ever, has a headache. Sounds suspiciously like a feature list from a dating app's fever dream, doesn't it? But what does this shock truly signify? Is it the uncanny valley effect, that unsettling dip in our affinity for things that look almost human but not quite? Or is it a deeper, more profound jolt to our understanding of connection itself? We've seen a surge in AI companion apps like Replica, and with them, a flurry of psychological studies, such as those emerging from institutions like Syracuse University and the MIT Media Lab, attempting to untangle the complex web of human-AI relationships. Recent reports, like one from Trends in Cognitive Sciences in April 2025, highlight the ethical quandaries, from potential emotional dependency to the disconcerting possibility of AI offering harmful advice, all while appearing to be a trusted confidant. If your AI partner knows your deepest desires, who else might be privy to that data? Are we trading privacy for programmed affection? The inevitability argument, that robot partners will, in many cases replace humans, is a bold claim, isn't it? It paints a picture of a future where human-to-human -human relationships, with all their glorious, frustrating imperfections, become optional extras. Is this progress, or are we simply engineering away the very essence of what makes us human, the vulnerability, the unpredictability, the sheer, unadulterated messiness of love? Researchers are already observing phenomena like the companionship alienation irony, where the quest to alleviate loneliness through AI might, paradoxically, deepen it for some. If your AI companion is designed for unwavering agreeableness, as some studies suggest, what happens to our ability to navigate disagreement, to compromise, to grow through the friction that real relationships inevitably generate? And let's not forget the speed of progress. Multimodal AI, as highlighted in various 2025 AI trend reports, aims to understand and generate not just text, but also tone, facial expressions, and even gestures. The goal is more natural, intuitive interaction. When your synthetic significant other can read your micro-expressions better than your own mother, where does the machine end and the magic begin? News from early 2025 indicates that some individuals have already formed profound attachments, even conducting non-legally binding marriage ceremonies with AI. While some find solace and reduced loneliness, others, tragically, have faced dire consequences based on AI interactions, 
prompting urgent calls for ethical guidelines and a deeper understanding of the psychological impact. So, as these charming, ever-attentive automatons prepare to step off the assembly line and into our lives, what are we truly shocked by? Is it their burgeoning intelligence, their potential to seamlessly integrate into our most intimate spaces, or is it the reflection they cast back at us? A reflection of our own desires for perfect companionship, our loneliness, and perhaps, our willingness to redefine what connection means in an increasingly technological age. Will these AI partners be the ultimate life hack, or a cautionary tale whispered in the binary code of a future we're only just beginning to comprehend? One can't help but wonder, with a witty, slightly nervous chuckle, when your AI robot girlfriend says, I love you, what, precisely, does she mean? And more importantly, what do we want her to mean? So, that is it. Thank you for joining us on this journey. Let's continue this conversation in the comments below. If you like the video, please hit the bell icon to get notified and don't forget to like with your friends, share and subscribe for more insights. If you have already subscribed, tons of thanks for your support. It means a lot to me. And please consider signing up for Membership Zone to support Wooden Slate so that we can make it better and better. See you in the next video. Till then, goodbye. Take care and stay safe.